Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a sword come back to you when you throw it. I'm going to be explaining every single chip in depth so you don't need any background information. See you there. Okay, so basically the first thing you'll be needing is your maker pen. Now you can go by opening your watch by looking at it, go into your backpack, then clicking use on the maker pen. You can also favorite it, click that favorite button, pull it out of your back. Oh, well. Okay, so first chip you'll need is a, well, whichever your dominant hand is, minus my right hand. So I'm gonna get a get, clear, right, and Just switch up hand. And if you scroll down, it should be there. Mine's the right one. If you let me find the left one. This is the left one. If you're left handed, then get this one. But place it down. And then you want to get a vector split. and then you want to get a greater than or equal to and then you want to put that right beside there okay so basically what this is doing is getting your player right hand velocity and then you want to wire that to the split so it splits into three the vector three stands for three different things y and the x y and z those are like Basically, it's speed with your direction. That's what velocity is. You want to wire that up to A. You want to get an if chip. And then you want to get an event receiver. You want to get the event receiver, configure it. Click on chip settings, event, scroll down until you see update 30 words. It's normally the last one. Wire it to above condition on the if chip. And then I'm just gonna steal, you wanna find this chip right here, click player dominant hand. If if it's if you're left-handed, then you get off-handed. And then you get it, and then you click then to there. And then you wanna spawn in a sword. Spawn a sword, and then you can want to configure the sword, and then let's add the tag sub. Okay. Sub scribe. Make sure you press that plus button, or it's not gonna work. And then you want to get rec room object get first with tag. Just search up Rec Room and it probably should come up as like the third one. And then you'll pull it over. You wanna wire object to object to equip. And then you wanna type the same tag that you gave the sword to here, so. Scribe. And then it's done. Okay, now will you make this? Okay, so three is good. If you wanna make it a little harder, then I'd probably say increase it, but slowly increase it, like do 3.5 and then four. Just play with it a little bit to where you like it. So once you do that, you wanna wire your 30, uh, event receiver 30 hertz and wire it to there. And right now it's set to local player, so it'll do it for anyone. But if you want to, Okay, search a good player by display name. I'm gonna put that over here. And then wire this up. And then just put in your name. 
Mine's peanut. Your display name. And then we'll add the same thing up to here. Okay. Now, if I if I do lift my hand up, it should come to me. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. Please drop that like and subscribe. Hopefully, Rectum will give me the tutorial down for this video. I know it's a little late, but still. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something from this video. And maybe you can use this in one of your maps. See ya.